Okay, we are going to solve problem 3.90 from Sadiku Box. So, we are given V0. V0 is here, is equal to 4 volt. And beta is 150. And VBE, VBE is here. The voltage between base and emitter is 0 0.7 volt. And let's label the current that will goes into and from transistor. So, this is IB. IB is always going inside transistor and because this is NPN transistor the current will goes out from emitter here so IE and this is IC okay now because we know the V0 here we know V0 here and we know the resistance here we can calculate IE by using Ohm's law so this is the voltage here for divided by this 500 ohm or 0.5 kilo ohm so ie is equal to 8 um, 8 milliampere okay so we have this IE and let's see what can we do next so we can use KCL at the transistor so the current that goes in is IB and IC plus IC and that will equal to this IE and IE is 8 IB is unknown but here IC IC we can get it from here beta is 150 so IC is equal 150 multiplied by IB okay we will have this is 150 IB so now we will have this as 151 multiplied by IB is equal to 8 milliampere or IB IB is equal to what is IB 8 divided by 151 so that's it 0 0.05 9.8 milliampere okay now we have IB and let's see what can we get from there okay now we take a look at this node here we know that V0 is 4 volt so the voltage at emitter will be at this point to the ground will be 4 volt but then we can use this fact that VBE is equal to 0 0.7 volt. So VB from the ground minus VE from the ground is equal to 0 0.7. And VB is unknown, but VE is known. V is known. So VB minus 4 is equal to 0 0.7 so i will have vb is equal to 4.7 volt so here we will have vb is 4.7 volt and ib is here ib and vb and we can use this fact to calculate vs how to do that let's do that so now we will have we have VB and IB here and we can take a look at this 10 kilo ohm resistor and we can apply ohm's law from here so IB is actually VS from the ground minus VB from the ground divided by 10 kilo ohm we know that IB is this value so we will have 0.0, .0 5298 is equal to Vs. Vs is unknown. 
and VB. VB is 4.7 and that will divide by 10. Okay, we can move this 10 to the left hand side. So I will have 0 0.5298 is equal to VS minus 4.7. So I will have VS is equal to 4.7 plus 0 0.5298. And what that means is 4.7 plus 0 0.5298 and I will have this as 5.22984 and this is our final answer for VS and let me know if I made any mistakes in the calculation. Thank you for watching.